Jeremy Clarkson has defended former Strictly Come Dancing judge Lynn Goodman from spotty teens after he sparked criticism at the Queen's Jubilee. Jeremy Clarkson, 62, spoke out in support of Lynn Goodman, 78, after he confessed during TV coverage of the Queen's Platinum Jubilee celebrations that his grandmother had sneered at the thought of cooking coronation chicken. According to her, the curry powder used to make it was foreign muck, but Jeremy has dismissed claims of racism. The response was immediate. Everyone with spots and hormonal issues ran around waving their pierced arms in the air and gnashing their tattooed teeth, saying that this colonial and racist attitude is exactly what's wrong with privileged white men today, he groaned. And, because it has the same spinal integrity as a sea anemone, the BBC instructed Claire Balding to issue an on-air apology for the offence, he continued in his The Times column. Jeremy declared the reaction nonsense and told the world that Head had enough. He insisted that Len's attitude was due to the cultural background that had been considered normal for his era. Pointing out that Len Goodman is now 78, he went on, he was brought up on a diet of Alf Garnett and Leonard Rossiter, who routinely made jokes about black people and women. Also, I am fairly sure I remember Terry Scott refusing a pizza in the BBC's Terry in June because he, like Len's granny, didn't like foreign muck. Jeremy described the scenes as typical of the world that the Strictly judge had been raised in. He added that Len's wife had prepared some coronation chicken just hours before Jubilee Day and that Head found it absolutely delicious. Jeremy urged that the public should praise Len for adapting to a more modern, progressive society. He commented on how the descendants of his era have created a society tolerant of gay weddings. The former Top Gear host recently attended a wedding of one of his close male friends to another man, something he admitted he would have considered unthinkable before it was legalized. 